Welcome back to Freeing ERP. My name is Haley and today we are going to be covering the basics of order entry in Profit21. In this video, I am going to discuss how to navigate to the order entry window in P21 and how to enter a new order. If you enjoy this video, be sure to leave us a like and subscribe to our channel for new P21 related content weekly. Now, let's get on with the video. In order to navigate to order entry, you'll first want to open the orders module and navigate to the order processing submodule. From there, you will open the transaction menu and select orders. You can also go to the search bar at the bottom of the navigation menu and search for orders and double click on the result that reads orders, order entry. When you open order entry, the first field you'll see is the order number field. Because we are entering a new order, you'll want to leave this field blank. P21 is going to auto assign an order number to the order after we save it. Next, we have the customer ID field. Enter your customer ID or double click in the field to search for the customer ID you need. You can double click in most fields to search for what you're looking for. After that, enter your ship to ID. If where you're shipping to does not have a ship to ID, you'll have to go to the ship to tab and enter your shipping info there. Once you have that entered, go ahead and enter your contact ID. Now that all of this is entered, you can enter your job number or customer PO number into their perspective fields. Next, input the required date. The required date is the day the order has to ship from the stocking location. If you have one, you can also enter your contract number. Below contract number is the quote checkbox. Whether or not this box is already selected depends on P21's user maintenance settings. If this box is checked, P21 will generate a quote instead of an order. Uncheck it to generate an order. Next step is to go to the items tab in the lower part of the screen. Enter your item ID and the item description will auto-populate. Next, enter the quantity ordered and hit tab. Select your UOM, then hit enter until P21 moves to the next item line. Repeat those steps until all of the items ordered have been added. Finally, hit save. If everything went according to plan, you should receive a pop-up that reads, Update was successful. Hit OK. Thanks for watching today's video on order entry. If you have any questions, be sure to leave us a comment. All of the timestamps for what we discussed in this video can be found in the description box. Before you go, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We post new videos every Tuesday. And leave a like on the video if you found it helpful. Also, make sure to check out our blog, Freeing ERP, and social media, which you can find linked on screen and down below. See you in our next video.